Hi you guys, I am back with another video and I know that it's been a long time coming um, but here I am and we're going to get right into it. This is a video about how to get rid of a dry TWA. Um, it doesn't matter if you just big chopped or um, where you are in your hair journey, how long you've been natural. Um, this is something that I believe um, that can help anyone who has been experiencing dry hair and you have natural hair. Um, this could possibly, I'm sure it can also be helpful if you are relaxed or wherever you are in your hair journey. Hopefully this can benefit you also. Um, however, the way that I discovered this method was because I had big chopped and I was experiencing severely dry hair and I didn't know what to do. I didn't know how to... Um, get rid of it. I didn't know how to retain moisture in my hair. First off, I um, I take uh, coconut oil, organic virgin. Um, first of all, you just, you're going to coat your scalp with it and then after that you're going to saturate your hair strands with it. Um, once you've um, applied the coconut oil, then you're going to take a plastic cap or even a plastic um, shopping bag, a grocery bag. Um, put that securely on your head and you can keep the oil in anywhere from um, 60 minutes to 24 hours. Some people do less and some people actually do even more than that. Um, and this uh, method is called, some people call it a pre-pool treatment, um, hair oiling. I like to refer to it as hair oiling because that's the way that I came across and discovered it. And I use it more um, for, um, in the hair oiling method rather than a pre-poo. And um, the reason why I say that is, is because typically I keep the oil in my hair for longer periods, um, usually uh, 24 hours unless I'm just rushing and I really don't have time to, to keep it in that long. However, so you're going to keep that oil in your hair um, with a plastic cap um, for 60 minutes. If you're, keep, if you're keeping it in for 60 minutes, um, you're going to wear a plastic cap. If you're keeping it in for 24 hours and you have to get up and go about your day, um, then you probably wouldn't wear a plastic cap. You would just wear your hair, but maybe um, just be mindful of exactly how much oil you're putting into your hair. Um, for me, um, what I typically do is I'll keep it in my hair around the house and then I'll sleep with it overnight with a plastic cap. Shampoo my hair when I'm ready to move to the next step. And my choice of shampoo is either um, Trader Joe's Tea Tree Tingle Shampoo or either the uh, Terra Essentials Clay Wash that I shared in a previous video. Um, so you're going to go ahead and shampoo your hair. Once you're done shampooing, you're going to go ahead and um, condition with the conditioner of your choice. Um, I have previously been using Auss Aussie Moist and um, Tresemme Naturals interchangeably. Um, however, um, and I know I just did a, a video on my regimen, I've moved away from using Aussie Moist because I um, feel like it had been locking moisture out of my hair because it does have silicones in it. Um, and you can do some research on silicones, silicones and how they affect your hair. Um, however, I, I really like the way my hair responds uh, better to the Tresemme Naturals. So I go ahead and condition with that. Um, once I'm done with my conditioning, um, I apply my moisture. And um, your moisture can be any water-based um, product or even water. Um, so what I choose for my moisture usually is either um, a 50-50 mixture of aloe vera juice and water and just go ahead and spray that into my hair. Um, or occasionally I will just choose to use the As I Am uh, leave-in conditioner. Okay, so it's the moisture of your choice, whatever works for your hair. Those are what work for me. Uh, once I've moisturized, I will typically go ahead and seal the moisture in with uh, jojoba oil or almond oil. And if I'm going too fast, guys, I'll put the products in the description box. Or either um, my, this is, is sort of a, a mixture of oils. It's a jojoba, almond oil, castor oil, olive oil, um, tea tree, and some other things. So the oil of your choice, whatever works for you. Um, and sometimes I'll do um, either of these or both of these. I will seal with an oil or with my shea butter or bo both. Um, 
but you do want to be mindful of, of the oil that you seal with. You want you don't want to use the oil that's too thick that it can um, lock moisture out of your hair, um, that it like over seals it, and you don't want to use um, an oil that um, causes your hair to dry out quickly because it's too thin. I think you should you know just kind of consider where you live, the climate, um, the weather and conditions, and all of that. Lately, for me, I live in a very cold climate. Um, especially in the winter time, I'm in the Midwest. Um, I do uh, lean more to toward the um, jojoba oil or the almond oil. Um, the castor oil it sealed moisture out of my hair for too long of uh, periods for me, um, although it is a good oil. So that's what I do. I, I seal my hair um, with an oil after I put the moisture back in, and typically that keeps uh, my hair moisturized. Um, and it, I'm telling you, it just completely got rid of any problems with dryness that, that I've had. This method really works well for me. It's what I do, um, and it is very effective. It's something that you can try. I hope that, um, if you are experiencing dryness that, um, this method works for you. I'll leave a comment in, in the box. Um, and just let me know how it works for you and even some um, things that you're moisturizing your hair with. How are you getting rid of dryness with your hair? Okay, I'd like to know that. So thank you so much for tuning in. Um, remember to rate, comment, or subscribe. You can find me on Instagram at Crown Jewel Hair, on Facebook at Crown Jewel Hair also. Um, I do also want to say um, that I thank you so much for your support. Um, the channel is, is growing and it's all because of you. Um, soon I'll be celebrating 1,000 subscribers and I would like to celebrate that with a giveaway. So you guys stay tuned. I'll see you in the next video guys. Bye bye.